This is just going to be a quick overview of the course to come. So Calculus 1. The first chapter we're going to be talking about limits. And if you've never heard of a limit then don't worry because we will start from the ground up. Chapter 2 will introduce something called a derivative. And if you remember one thing, remember that derivative is just slope is slope. And that's really all it is. It, and, and slope, hopefully you remember the formula y2 minus y1 over x2 sorry about that, over x2 minus x1. Okay, and, and the derivative is just a combination of, of a limit and this slope formula. And that's all a derivative is and we'll learn all about the derivative in chapter 2. So chapter 2 is learning all about the derivative and being able to find derivatives. Chapter 3 we'll start looking at at uses for the derivative. In fact we'll even start that in chapter 2 but uses for the derivative. And the uses for the derivative we'll start talking about about the relationship between a derivative and a function and 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 stuff like that so so two uh, there's only four chapters two of them are about the derivative and I just told you that derivative is is just slope so hopefully this is putting your mind at ease a little bit that this course is really it won't be that difficult and then four we're gonna talk about integration integration so if you've heard of an integral, that, that will be introduced, both a definite integral and an indefinite integral. If you don't know what that means, don't worry, you're not supposed to. That's what I'm going to teach you in Chapter 4. And we'll see how a derivative and an integral are, are related. A derivative and an integral are, are quite related. Okay, so four chapters. There's a lot of lessons in each chapter, but just work through them at your own pace, or if, if you're in a class and you need a specific topic, Hopefully you can use this guide to, to try and guide you where to find it. So, good luck. I, I know you'll do fine. Just take it slow. You could always watch the videos over and over again if something is confusing you. And if something's really confusing you, then feel free to email me and, and I'll try and help you out by email or, or maybe I'll even make a video to clarify what, what your question is. Okay, so that's it. That's calculus in a nutshell, and it, it's, it won't be too difficult if, if you just are patient and, and give, it, give it a little bit of effort. Okay, see you, see you in lesson one.